Oh, cool! On Steps the Zombie, we could play it together. It's for easy mode, but humans are almost as brain good as the zombies. I think walk. Let's see, humans put up a solid fight on normal, but nothing to stand down. Tough. For the discriminating zombie, who wants a more challenging opponent? It's saying, you'll wish you never crawled out of your grave. Let's go first. <laughs> Whoops. Shoot. I just realized. Quit. I did not just scream. Dead. What's going on? Well enough. Okay, that's okay. It's being goofy. Oh, that was first bug of the game. Oi, Bay. Guys, I'm yeah, rebooting it. Give me a moment. Hiya. Uh, yeah. Reboot that game. Hurry up. Epic, please. Epic. Do, 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 do. Do 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 do. Make <laughs> up your mind. <laughs> it froze. I think they meant to your uh, yep, and then Adams. <laughs> On. I need to go to Epic because it's still acting goofy, even though I closed it. Launch. City has entered the 21st century 50 years ahead of schedule. Welcome to Punchbowl, a city built for the space age. Here in Punchbowl, experimental science and state-of-the-art technology create a futuristic paradise the likes of which have never been seen. This is a city unlike any other, free of crime, pollution, poverty, and other urban blights. Menial labor is a thing of the past, thanks to all the robots who keep Punchbowl running like clockwork. People can't stop talking about it, and why should they? Punchbowl is a model of good old American ingenuity. 
much of it developed by famed scientist Dr. Herman Y. Now a naturalized American citizen working for the good guys. But who's funding this fantastic foray into futurism? Why, none other than billionaire playboy industrialist Andrew Monday. America's favorite rags to riches story is the visionary who's calling the shots in this town. At the grand opening ceremony this morning, the world's richest man had this to say. Here in Punchbowl, for the first time in human history, life is what it was meant to be, free of all unpleasantness. Why, someday the entire world will be like Punchbowl, but for now, it stands alone, a beacon of purity and human potential in a world of social upheaval and moral turpitude. Bold words from a bold man. But perhaps the only thing more unlikely than this orphan's rise to fame and fortune is the city he's built, where everyone is invited to drink their fill of the future, and no one has a care in the world. Get your hands off my weenie! Good morning. Is everything okay? He stole my hot dog! Well, that wasn't very nice. Stealing isn't allowed in Punch Bowl. You have to give it back. If you'd like something to eat, I can show you one of Punch Bowl's many fine dining establishments. Yeah, go eat something else, jerk. Go on, get out of here. He stole my hot dog. Oh my, oh my goodness! Oh my! Looks like he's having some kind of brain seizure. We better find some way of relieving the pressure in his head. Oh God! Oh, oh, I like this. That is just sick. Wow! You sure calm him down. He's not even twitching anymore. Mm. Mm. Oh, silly me! I haven't even introduced myself. I'm a guide bot here to provide any information oh, you might goodness. need during your stay in our fair city. <laughs> Would you like the full tour? Not really. Oh, come on. I can tell by the look on your face. You're gonna love Punch Bowl. Follow me. We've got so much to see. I've got a whole data tape filled with 640 kilobytes of fun facts about Punch Bowl. It'll take us a few hours to get through the whole thing. Why don't we just walk around a bit so you can get your bed? You get around pretty well for someone with a gaping hole in his stomach. If you like, we can visit Punch Bowl General Hospital and have that looked at. Oh, but there's so much to see first. Come along. There seems to be go. some kind of commotion down the street. Never a dull moment in Punch Bowl. Let's go have a look. Good morning. It's a robot. Be quiet, be quiet guys. Guys. Not... All right, buddy. You're coming with us. But officer, we just started the tour. The tour's over. We don't want a sick bum in an ugly tie walking around on opening day stinking up the place. Nor do we actually want to touch that guy. Ugh. Exactly. So we're just going to stand here nice and quiet. And you are going to get in the back of the squad car. And we'll all be happy. Well, I will be happy. We're waiting. Tap, tap, tap. I guess you don't have any choice. We can wait. I've got a wife and kids. My partner. Freeze. No, it's Robin. What is it? Oh, I see. You got gas. I'll just head over here for a minute while you, uh, relieve the pressure. All right, buddy, you're going down. Hands where I can see him. Oh, come on. Fire match. Go, 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 Um, my zombie army. Yeah, this is the bot. Oh, we'll never get anywhere unless you push those fellas out of the way. Walk up behind one of them. 
Now give him a gentle shove in the right direction. Ooh. Wonderful! Now we can continue the tour. Well, why don't you call your new friends over? First, stand perfectly still and transfix them with your steely gaze. Now purse those lips and whistle. Well done. They're heading right over. Now, we still have a lot to see, and I don't want you collapsing of exhaustion before the tour ends. So if you feel tired or winded or in agonizing pain because someone just ran up and slugged you for no reason... Ow! Then feel free to take a few seconds to relax and recuperate. You'll feel much better after a few deep breaths. All right? Excellent! I'll be over by the gate when you're ready to tour the green. We need to go to said robot. I'm gonna see if I can eat some more people. Ah, Next to the robot then. Arrgh. Well yeah, the robot is your story. Let's 
go to the movies and get us some fresh brains. You know there are no brains in there. Oh, it's not. It's not a movie theater. It's a monorail. You asked for it. You like that? I'm bringing you in. Oh, you got my brain! Spit that out, damn it! Oh. Oh. Who's panting? Like a quick getaway? The punch ball monorail is the best way to get around the city. This is the chief! What the hell is going on out there? You would not believe the calls we're getting at the station! Help me! Help me! Something's trying to eat my brain! Sounds like a sick dog or something. You boys better lock things down pronto! Mr. Monday wants everything perfect today! Masters, out! Anyone else out of books? Yep. <laughs> the monorail is arriving. Please keep clear of the track. Welcome to the Fertile Crescent Biome, where the grass is always greener. Today at the world's most advanced greenhouse, meet me, Maggie Monday. Is everything satisfactory this Monday? Monday? Yes, honey. Are you sure you don't need anything? A, a cold drink? No. Cigarette? No. Foot massage? Uh, I'm... what? Uh, nothing. Uh, never mind. You're a nice man, Mr. Skegness, but don't you have better things to do than make passes at your employer's mother? I'm just doing my job, Miss Monday. Andrew asked me to look after you, and I'm going to make sure uh, nothing unseemly happens on this... Uh, Wonderful. Sunny. Fabulous. Sunny. Huge. Eyes up here. Day. Now, come with me, Miss Monday. This doesn't look like a safe place for you. Perhaps we can go back to my place. Nice try, Mr.
crashed on his end. It did. But I think this is one of the things that the people kept complaining about. That seems like it'd be a good game if it wouldn't do that. Yeah. I was actually having fun. Where it was almost as much fun as uh, doing destroy all humans. <laughs> oh well. Well folks, I'm sorry, but this game keeps crashing on us. So, once I have this posted to YouTube, at least you'll get to see some gameplay of it. Hopefully I can get it to work for us. If not, you'll see several videos yeah. and hopefully my save file will not be corrupted. Otherwise, I will have to start all the way over with a new game. So... Bye.